This is a raft and I'm lost in the ocean on it. Well, more like this raft. And for the next 100 days, I have to make automated farms, create more villagers and trades, and also obtain god armor. Except there's one teeny tiny problem that kind of affected this entire world in the worst way possible. It was a genuine mistake and I can't undo it. I hope you all understand what's about to happen. Now, here's me surviving 400 days on a raft. Enjoy. So yeah, just a, just a little hi. Can I make this? Nope, I can't. Tee hee hoo hoo, I made an oopsie boo boo. I don't know what I was saying there, I'm sorry. I apologize for that. Should go around and finish off this line. Not like that. Like the cooling tower up here, my god, that thing is huge. Not like that. Can I help you, dude? I swear on my life I did not uh, plan that out. Because if I ever plan out anything, I don't know why I had to clarify that. Ah, the beautiful raft, and we're back again for another 100 days. Okay, first off, just because I'm not gonna lie, I don't remember. Do I still have villagers over here? Oh, why, yes, I do. We have a lot of you. Okay. And, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. I remember you now. Okay, so, I don't think any of the villagers in here still have any food on them, so I think we're fine. I... I swear I, oh God, wait, do I need to like take meds or something? I don't know where they went. Um, anyways, if I can put you there, perfect. Uh, that's right, yeah, yeah, I'm ready. I remember how uh, dire the food situation was. So, eh, at the very least here, you guys can do like some kind of like work with this if you want. Oh God, they're already making work, no. No, 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 there we go. Okay, beautiful and beautiful. Okay, so yeah, that's right. So we can still make two more librarians, which we might might want to but i don't know because i know that we are getting somewhat low on uh the emeralds that i just can't find so that probably means that we are very low on them so maybe a lot of the villagers actually that we have that we have uh stored away in here yeah we'll just turn them into stick traders oh our fishies are still here oh and they look so happy and not depressed in there beautiful oh no wait i don't know oh no i don't have any sticks actually here let's go visit our lovely spruce tree farm because i don't think i actually have any more sticks and if i do i believe that it's actually like super low oh my god this takes so much time i can't believe it's already night time okay beautiful we're planted everything time for bed okay so i might come back to regret doing this however since we just have so many tree farms i really don't think that it'll matter so let's just turn all of this into sticks also i'm just gonna apologize right now about it since i have like five or six series going on um I, I kind of don't remember what i was doing in here but i do remember this and how i have a specific amount of uh blocks to go for like a pattern on this i i at least remember that you know so it's not it's not too bad and yoink we take the invisible baby again i swear i i don't need medication there is someone in my hands I, i'm not joking you guys can see him too right like it's not just me right maybe i'm doing something wrong maybe i actually don't need that many stick traders a one a two and a three and oh well i was gonna say four brother but um apparently uh that's an issue oh wait i do have honey speaking of honey so let's go through you yep, no no don't put that up okay just don't mind me anyone yep also i should probably mention uh episode uh, like the 300 days hasn't gone live yet so i don't really know what you guys have uh, said about it as it's not live so uh yeah that'll be fun once uh, you know whenever it does if i don't finish recording this before it does hey if you're enjoying the movie so far i got a challenge for you you see, my raft uses a lot of glass, and glass takes forever to get. But I'm willing to do a deal with you. YouTube tells me how many people subscribe per video, and for every subscriber I gain on this video, I'll go and collect 10 glass blocks. Maybe we can turn the entire ocean into glass at this rate? Anyways, back to the movie. Out of there, brother. So don't worry, I've actually learned. So we're gonna pick you up, and then we put you into there so that then you don't, you know, be tempted to walk around and like socialize or, I don't know, take a different job block than what I need need and then we put you there and then i pick you up and put you into your forever home and yep immediately you take sticks love you okay so we can at least go around fill up all of the other holes pause these are going to be future ones so might as well just put the honey in there now there's really no point in me uh, storing it anywhere so we can have two more of you guys and then two librarians i think we're pretty good on all the stick trades i'm really not stressing about that whatsoever so i think we get back 
back to doing librarians. But, it, it, you know, it shouldn't take that long. And that's right there is when Skies was mistaken because he's dealing with villagers. So, of course, it's going to take long. Alrighty, who wants to be a nerd and sell me some books? Okay. Okay, let's see. Do you want to give me feather falling? Nope. You just want to give me neurotoxins. Okay, come then come. Or maybe we're getting to a point to where I shouldn't go for a specific one because I remember other falling three. Wait, was that the max? Eh, of course not. It's four, not three. Eh. <gasps> oh, uh, uh. Okay, wait, but that, that's only 34. That's not the worst. But wow, okay. I, I've gotten feather falling four. Uh, that was really strange. That took like four or five refreshes. That really was kind of fast and nice. And wow, I guess uh, narrator wasn't correct. Uh, that actually did go fast. And yeah, we'll just put you there for now. Nice little future proofing. And yeah, boop, there we go. Don't worry, I'm, I'm trying really hard to not say the B word. You know, starts with a B and it ends in beautiful. And boop, take you. Please be like the last villager and actually be fast. Okay, this will be the villager that gives me terrible ones. Oh, wait, I forgot your sign. You are Feather Falling 4. I'm pretty sure Bane of Arthropods 5 is the maximum one, and I do know how I said that I want to get every single enchantment in the game, but I kind of really don't care to get enchantments like that that I've, I don't think I've ever used that in my entire life on Minecraft. And Paling 4, I'm pretty sure that's for tridents, but I'm not positive on that one either. Oh, and... Maybe we actually take this because I have I have an idea that I want to try out and I think you would be really good help for it. Is that um I kind of want to see if I can make an ice farm because I would like to have an automatic sorting system and I think to uh, combat a whole lot of lag, which, you know, I won't lie, I'm starting to notice that in my world it is starting to get bad. So I think by using ice instead of just all hoppers, we'll be able to actually make like a really uh, solid item sorting system, probably be a lot faster than only hoppers and it should use a lot less lag I, I don't know what the other versions do like i don't know if it makes like the ice area bigger but if i'm making an ice farm i'm pretty positive it's just going to be like a one block wide lane i kind of want to collect that thing i'm not gonna lie i think i'm going to collect that thing like, I, I know that i already have one of the flying fish but i think that's a different color scheme than what i have but anyways that's my thought process around are you really? I talked for like 30 seconds, maybe a minute. What? Okay, fine. I guess we're not going to be having Frostwalker right now, but I do want to get Frostwalker in the future. No, not punch one. I, I will punch you though. Ooh, that might be a good one. And now I kind of really just want to make you Frostwalker now after you did that to me. <sighs> okay, actually, uh, wait, no, 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 I can't make a stand. I need to very quickly go get some paper. So instead of having Frostwalker, I'll get Respiration 3, because I think that was like one of the last enchantments that I need for my helmet. I have one book. That's fine. Oh my god, please don't refresh. Please, 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 please. Yes, yes, still here. Oh, I have enough just by one. Okay, beautiful. Oh, thank god for once you didn't screw me over. And let me just, and that's actually like the last one that I can do. So now it's time to go and have some fun. Okay, first off, let's go, go, go down. There we go. And I don't Oh, nice. They are different colors. And then, oh, yes, yes. Nemo, but flying. Okay, beautiful. Ooh, our fish collection is coming along so well. Okay, so we have a whole lot of sticks now. Some on the floor. And let's just very quickly go make a whole lot of emeralds because this is starting to become an issue. Okay, beautiful. We at least have 49. And speaking of 49, let's go check out the bees again. I love how fast all of these bees work. Beautiful. At least three more spots. I might want to make that bigger, but I honestly don't know know if I want to. Boop. And let's go see if I could figure out my old pattern. That's six. So it's nine blocks wide, I believe. I think that's how far I need to make this go. Yeah, I just need to make a nine wide. Okay. This shouldn't be too difficult. I, I've never confused myself before on anything that I've ever built. Oh god, they haven't even done anything. Oh no, wait, that's right. Don't I need to pick up and place down the beds again? Yeah, that's, yeah, because there's no babies in here, but I remember you guys making hearts, so for whatever reason, you know, I don't know why I have to do this every single time. Okay, there we go, and then if I go get more food, if I even have any more food, let's see. Pretty please. Yeah, not, not the worst. Two stacks. Oh, almost three. Okay, wow. Potatoes really put in the effort, huh? Here you go, guys. Don't worry. I made sure to not wash off the carrots or the potatoes so you guys can have all that delicious dirt. Mmm, a lot of iron in that. And, of course, you guys just had to give them food. <sighs> 
God, I hate it whenever they do that. I, I still wish that I could just steal from children, you know? Like, I just, I'd love to just go and just take all the, I, like, I'm not going to continue that. Okay, so since we need to wait for all of the farms to get more food and for the babies to grow, I'm going to go with everything on the helmet is done. I'm I'm pretty sure, I, God, I haven't done this in a while. That's why I can't remember. Oh, wait. Ooh, I don't have thorns. Okay, well, here, since I like having thorns on it, just so, you know, I can uh, protect myself nice and easy from, like, fish or anything else trying to harm me but i just want to see if i can even add all of these enchantments to my helmet because i have actually had an issue in the past before where uh it becomes too expensive yeah like that i i actually don't think i can add thorns to this which it isn't the worst you know because the helmet and the boots are the ones that take the most enchantments compared to like the chest and the pants so maybe i just have thorns not be on my helmet and my boots and then i'll just have thorns on my chest and legs which I, I think that'd be like the best outcome. Now I just need to get four more levels. So now we're somewhat getting into the problematic area of enchanting where usually like, you know, if I was on one of my normal one block worlds, I wouldn't be an issue because this thing would just be pumping these out like a couple on Valentine's Day. And you know, boom, I would just get to level 30 super duper fast. However, I don't have that luxury because I just have to have all this beautiful water and fishies. So instead, we actually just need to keep trading. But we also need to wait for the villagers i don't think we're that dire on it yet but i can start farming Ooh, like get some glass or some more lanterns which that'll also give me xp actually no 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 no. here we're gonna be smart we're gonna think about the future and the future of planet earth and we're gonna go and destroy more of its forests so this way i could just sell it all back to the villagers make some uh emeralds and get xp Whew, beautiful and we still got some time hopefully i can complete my helmet today uh, hello there, brother. You look like a man who would really like to buy some sticks and buy into my course. Have you heard about NFTs? Don't worry, I'll teach you how to make as much money as me as long as you go out and buy my $500 a month course. Trust me, you'll make all the money back and more. It is the greatest investment of your life. Hello there, villager. If you are not a multi-quintillionaire by the age of 18, give up. You are a loser in life. And there we go. So we have almost two stacks of emeralds we're wow actually level 32 so we can go to this i would love to rename it trust me i would totally love to do that and give it like a funny name maybe like dior shades or something i don't know but yeah let's just not make it more expensive and boop and a bing and wow do i look clean but very nice we now are a little bit you know we're, we're, we're another step closer to actually having good armor and actually being you know protected ah why does it have to be smooth stone ah and now just because it's like, I don't know. I, I think it'd be kind of fun to have it. Um, we can put it... Eh, I'll just put it here. I, I could put all of my iron armor that I have right now, and we'll just, you know, we'll just put it right there. And then it's like something to uh, remember the past about, you know, like, oh, that was the armor that I was wearing. I don't know. Ooh, maybe those scary monsters in the ocean ain't so bad. And yeah, let's actually go through, collect some of this. And then if any of you have seen my Lost at Sea series, maybe I'll remake that uh, kelp farm in here. Might want to go watch it if you like this uh, ocean vibe. And oh my god. God, dude, I forgot how nice it is to actually have a helmet with respiration on it and aqua infinity. Like, oh, dude, this is incredible. I can actually go swimming and not drown after two seconds in the water. Anyways, here, we'll start. Oh my God, that's a lot. Okay, well, we'll start cooking that up. Let that all go. Okay, so very luckily for expanding that uh, villager trading outpost, it seems like we have a decent amount of wood there. Uh, the one thing, though, is that I don't believe that I have any more more leaves. Oh my god, I have leaves. Okay, never mind. Ignore me. Okay, so let's just start with the outside first. So one, two, nine. Okay. I, like, I'm pretty sure that's, like, a section from this. Like, I'm pretty sure it's every nine. I should really just leave a sign. Oh, dang it. I should really just leave a sign, like, somewhere on here, like, whenever, like, I get to the end of a movie, or at least, like, a book, and be like, oh, yeah, by the way, this is how big this is, and, like, this is how you built that. It would probably really help me out in the long run. But that sounds really smart to do, so I don't really want to do it, because it's more entertaining this way to see if I can actually manage to remember my stuff. And then, I believe for this section, it was 
mainly like a uh, oh God, like a uh, like a checkered board. I think that's right. Yeah, because this is where honey goes. This is glass. Perfect. This looks absolutely confusing, but I think it's correct. And then for over here, I believe. I go like one block out, then we do two, then we go one. Okay, nice, nice. So this pattern is at least really simple to follow. Chop down you. Okay, I think that I went through and I copied over all of the little wooden patterns correctly. I don't think I need to fix anything. And then it seems like it's super easy. I only have one. Oh, okay. Well, what I'm trying to say is that it, it looks like it's super easy. I think I just go through and just add in these expensive logs facing this direction. Oh my God. God, I'm so good at placing stuff. Oh, I'm such a professional. Oh, I need lanterns. Oh, I need lanterns really bad. Oh, I should probably mention. So I do remember before how I said that I had a mod where these are supposed to grow. For whatever reason, they're still not growing. I'm like 95% like certain that I actually did add the mod and I don't think that they're supposed to be taking that long to grow. So yeah, just a, just a little hi, sad update there. I mean, I'll, I'll look into the mod again at some point because I really do want to actually uh, grow coral uh, reefs around everywhere. Like, especially at nighttime, It'll be super duper beautiful. Now, speaking of super duper, go through, add in this lovely glass flooring. And boop. There we go. Okay, right side should be done. Looking fancy. Oh, God, hi. Oh, no, I put down the wrong glass. Doesn't matter. God, it's so nice to actually have silk touch. Again, I think that's all for glass. Now, the hardest part is going to be honey, especially for the center part, because uh, I need to go and put down slabs below all of the honey because it kind of, I don't know. I mean, I could just do this, but I just, yeah, it's kind of annoying.
the way, like.
I had to fill them all up with water, which that took like a hot minute. And then I covered up all of the Now, day 343. On trivia, this is like one of my favorite numbers. I placed down the rest of the pistons, put some pretty blocks on top of them, filled up everything with redstone, which don't worry, it'll work, I think. And then I started placing down some of the sugar cane. But then I thought, well, if I put down all of those slabs with water and I kind of want sugar cane right now, just so I can get paper and do a lot of trades with that. And you know, sugar cane is super slow. I figured, eh, we'll just make this all sugar cane and instead of bamboo and sugarcane. So I'll probably build this exact same thing on the other side for bamboo, who knows? But anyways, I encased it all into glass, finished up everything or like all the important parts, slapped a uh, daylight sensor on the roof with an observer facing it. And the farm is basically done. Towards nighttime, I did turn on and off the daylight sensor just to make sure that everything works. And I believe every single corner of the farm actually does get triggered. So I don't think I need to like put down any kind of repeaters or try out anything really tricky and stuff. And now I basically just need to wait for the sugar cane to grow so I could fill up every single part of this with sugar cane. And then I believe with the daylight sensor, it'll actually trigger this to go off pretty rapidly because I'm pretty sure as the sun goes up and down, it changes the power levels of this block, which I guess I'm down for. But at the same time, it does worry me a little bit just for lag. And we're finally done. Um, I don't know how long it usually takes for sugar cane to grow but it uh but it is a little surprising on how long it is taking now since the farm is you know basically done i just need to uh, get more sugar cane for it i won't lie i've been playing a whole lot of destiny too and there's a very specific building style in there if you played the witch queen dlc and i kind of want to design this farm with that aesthetic in mind. So I kind of want to make this very sharp. Not, not really too curvy. Maybe towards the top comes out like a little bit. Some like nice spikes going up on all corners. Uh, we also very desperately need to fill in all of this. And I still have no idea how I'm going to be doing this area. However, I kind of want to go exploring after being in here for so long. Uh, so yeah, let's just throw away some of the stuff into our chest right here. Let's go take our little boat and let's head out i don't know let's go this direction you know i kind of want to see if i can find more land see if we can get some sugar cane from it won't lie i'd rather just you know speed it along like that instead of waiting for those to grow because i don't know why but sugar cane always takes forever in the beginning and then after you've been farming it for a little bit then it actually starts producing things really fast wow the ocean is really empty oh some islands finally we actually found some land hello beautiful oh yes yes please keep getting bigger yes yes i see sugar cane already Ooh, and i destroyed another portal hello darn i actually got excited i thought that this was a village for a second oh wait now that I finally have Silk Touch, dude, whenever I find any of these sea lanterns uh, anywhere, I can actually collect them. Why, hello, massive area. And I am seeing a lot of sugarcane everywhere. Ooh, anything special here for me? <gasps> yes, okay, good, good. Golden apple, don't really care for anything else. Ooh, it's another one of you. Wait, 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 what's up, homie? Thank y'all. Or you can come back home with me. I got a nice, uh, very well put together aquarium for you. Oh, that's so nice. Oh, dude. Oh, dude. It's, it just keeps going. Hey, bud. Yeah. Why'd you, uh, why'd you zoom over here, huh? Okay, fine. <sighs> Whatever. Don't want you either. No, no, it's cool. No, no, it's you. Definitely not me. And perfect. Wow. So we got a stack and almost a half of sugar cane. We could probably even find some more along our way home, but that's definitely more than enough to actually make some paper for us. We could trade that. Oh, and there's even more sugar cane right here. We can then finish up the farm. So it was a nice little uh, cute trip. Now the only issue is, uh, where did I come from? <laughs> oh, okay, wait, I remember that. Okay, wait, wait, I think I found the way. Wow, do not want to fall into there. Okay, now if my assumptions are correct, I believe my base is this direction. <gasps> oh, yes, yes, I found it, yes. Oh, my beautiful home, how I've missed you. Alrighty, let's go put you with your brother in here. Boop, there you go. Okay, dear God, that took so much longer than what I was expecting. Hi, you're loud. And beautiful, we have sugar cane all around the farm. And wow, I had the exact amount of glass, nice. 
I like that tutorial. Okay, so with that entirely going... Oh, one of them finally grew. Oh, finally progress. Let's see, has any been collected? Okay, you've produced 10, not bad. You know, I, they weren't able to grow while I was out exploring. And instead of actually just storing all of that uh, sugar cane here, we're just gonna turn it all into paper. Also gonna grab all of these emeralds. And then let's start working on you. Why not? Oh my God, that is 24 paper. What, are you all the same? Oh, oh, oh God. Oh geez. Okay, so maybe we want to build like two or 10 more of those sugarcane farms. Um, I'm also just going to take a wild guess here and say that that is most definitely not, where am I going? Going to become our uh, main source of emeralds. So yeah, I'm not putting too much hopes into it. So yeah, let's definitely make a bamboo farm after this here let's see have we made any progress on gaining any more since i've been here okay we got five we'll just store the paper in there oh nice we've gotten nine okay but um anyways so we should start at least focusing on this side for expanding it forward so so we'll have the glass in here and then this is when we're going to start getting into the wood i don't think we're going to be needing that much glass but i also am not putting any hopes into that whatsoever i have a feeling that it's going to be ending up uh, being a lot and that was all the glass <laughs> oh boy all right uh, here, just so we don't mess it up, let's actually just be smart, bring this forward. I'm very glad that I went back and I raised it up by one. Yeah, if I didn't do that, then we would have had a problem. Beautiful platform is almost done, basically. So here, let's just get a little organized, put away all of this stuff, don't need it. Noise. Everything's replanted. Oh god, the lag is returning. <laughs> okay, but we should be having a lot of sticks from this, hopefully a whole lot of profit. Okay, beautiful, nearly a stack and a half hopefully with all of this you guys can actually saw me a whole lot we have so much work to do there we go yep do that okay beautiful please for the love of god sell me glass please <sighs> no ah, that's where the glass should have been no it was all wasted emeralds well very luckily with this amount i think we should be able to finish off the entire floor which now just need to go through and then very carefully like i'm pretty sure if water got in here nothing bad would happen but i just don't really want to like see what would happen if water got in here so. Ooh, and we're already up to 48 okay you're starting to work faster and now thinking about it, I actually probably should have gone through and removed all of that dirt. Well, very luckily, I do have the helmet to actually survive down here and do this. I'm almost a little tempted to clean out some of the sand in here, just so we don't have, like, a sand view like this. It might look kind of nice maybe actually well here let's let's go through and just clean out some of it oh yeah, yeah that definitely looks a lot nicer we got 52 glass and a dream so let's see if i can actually uh, at least do one line of this and the answer for that is no uh i think i'll leave this though just because it looks kind of funny to me and, Ooh, now thinking about it let's actually go back check out the bees again it's been several months hello how are you all doing oh yeah, uh, no not that there we go i definitely think at some point i'm probably gonna swap out all of the uh trap doors on there with some more um campfires just add in some more beehives because yeah definitely think that we are going to be needing some more bees but we are level 32 and i kind of okay let's get rid of you i kind of want to you know uh max out something else as well honestly i think god do i want to do a diamond axe because then i'm gonna have to worry about healing it Ah, let's do it. Okay, we got efficiency five and mending. Okay, let's see. Well, we definitely need on breaking three. Ooh, and we're gonna want some silk touch on that. Nice and cheap. And I think that's all really. I mean, there might be some modded enchantments that I can actually put on the axe. But we'll just deal with that later. Also, wait, do I not have any sharpness? I could have sworn I had sharpness five somewhere. Wait, I never got sharpness five. I, I could have sworn I got that at some point. I'm pretty sure that's everything. And let's go through, make everything as cheap as possible. Okay beautiful and then okay <gasps> oh we just need savage and then we can actually uh get a maxed out axe with oh god that's gonna be so nice for the wood farm beautiful work oh wait do i want to make it a funny name i kind of do actually i'm not gonna lie i, I want to name it something really good that i think you'll all enjoy very quickly there we go uh, our maxed out axe called a question <laughs> Get it? You guys, you guys get it? Right? You, you guys see <laughs> 
Okay, so very luckily now we should actually be able to complete this entire glass floor. No, I just need eight more. <laughs> no. Ladies and gentlemen, there we go. Done. Hmm. Okay, so just so I can, you know, get some time to actually think about, like, what would I want to do here? Oh, wait, scratch that. I can't, oh, no, 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 because that goes into the design of it. But, God, like, I really want to put some water down here so, uh, just to block off all of the levers. Just in case if I ever need a water bucket my way up on top of this thing, then, you know, they don't get destroyed. Actually, here, we'll just make a nice staircase. That right there is some beautiful dirt. Now, I think, you know, we should have, like, some nice peaceful times now, you know? Just something really easy doesn't take me that much work to actually prepare all of it or just so we don't run out of leaves anymore uh, i think once all of these fully grow we're just gonna go through and just use shears and just chop down like all of the trees or just collect all of the leaves oh boy that's either fireworks or that's thunder and i might just want to stop recording soon so of course we could just go and use some of the vanilla blocks like we always do with builds but i kind of want to see if there's anything special with the modded block not with that with the modded blocks <sighs> Maybe we could do something with a steep roof. Ooh, yes, yes, yes. So we can actually try something in reverse for once, and then it gives us a nice steep look. Actually, here, instead of doing the entire way around, what we can then do is maybe do like three. We skip two, do three more, and then we're all out of those. So we need to go make more. And those blocks, we go, oh my God, wow. Uh, Maybe this will actually work? Ooh, yeah, maybe that will actually work because I do want to cover up this maybe. Well, you know, we'll leave the glass visible. So this can like lead into some sort of pillar oh okay so we go here and we do two let me go one two three four one two one two three four okay yeah, yep nope that didn't work uh, oh god oh god nope nope definitely time to go to sleep nope don't strike my base please i mean i guess that can work so we do it every three, but then in the center, I guess I can actually work out so then we can actually see more of the glass inside. I guess, no, no, cause that doesn't work. So I don't like that because it's kind of hard to tell the difference between them. I mean, maybe we try it out with stone and we might be able to do something nice with that. Just so it's a little bit lighter. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah I like that a lot more. And then, of course, I didn't bring any with me. Okay, well, at least I'm getting in my 30,000 steps today. Uh, okay, so we don't really want to block out any of the glass. So maybe we do some deep slate facing here. And then we actually copy this again up here. That might be fine. Like, I don't think I hate that. And then deep slate going down down and then maybe we try out that just so this has like a stronger look just so it's not so like weak and pathetic looking like how it is right now especially with those i think i like that i don't think that's bad yeah i'm kind of enjoying that and then just so we can actually add in some color and just because like i have so much more wood than i do with stone then we can go around to the edges right here and maybe we strip these oh i like that there we go some good stripping action uh, youtube don't hurt me Ooh, I kind of like that. I kind of do want to block the glass, like at these sections though. Or at least make it like a thin strip going over just so it looks like something's encasing it. But, oh, maybe we want to focus down here before we go up there. I, I, I think I like wood being down here as well. Uh, maybe we strip this. Again, th this is becoming one of those builds where I have no vision whatsoever. I'm just randomly placing down everything and, you know, uh, fingers crossed that it, it just works. I think that works. I don't I don't think I hate this. But these feel really empty and I almost I almost think that adding signs is going to be the uh, the nice touch. Let's see. I think I like that the most, especially just to break up all of the, uh, the deep slates. Yeah, yeah, I think that's definitely the move. Now we just need to focus up here. Okay, first off, let's get rid of the dirt. I actually don't need this. Actually, yeah, no 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 before we even touch the top so this bottom section i think we're fine relatively we can copy this to every single side i don't think i need to worry about anything being like special or specific Okay, perfect. And then on the sides, this actually works out insanely well. We just go through and add in four stone this time. And then while I at least have all of these signs, we can go through, slap these down on the center pieces. Okay, now if I can hopefully do this correctly, I just need copy over all of these sides. Then across all of these, is there going to be leaves? These are signs. Now, regardless of all of the leaves, I 
think I've copied this over correctly, but I'm going for like a very strong industrial look. And I think we've actually reached that like pretty successfully. And now thinking about it, as I am talking, it is incredibly dark in here and I am a little worried about things spawning. Now the difficult part, I mean, kind of difficult part. I could just mimic how I, I like I've been doing it, but I kind of want to try a different design for the butt of the machine over here. I'm almost wanting to add in more hoppers and actually replace this. I don't think I'm okay with that being the spot to collect it from. Oh wait, no, I can just put the hoppers here, like right across there. Oh wow, I think that would work. I think I just talked it into existence because I don't really see any issues happening with that and I need a lot more hoppers. Oh, and perfect. I just had two chests waiting for me right Right there now okay this is gonna be so difficult to actually make this right in the center so we take away these two just so it doesn't come out like super awkward i actually think just right there is perfectly fine up here just you know it looks so weird blah 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 and yeah we're definitely gonna have to do something about that i don't like how we can see through that now we need to go oh actually no no, no okay we're, we're gonna plan it out once you know we're gonna make this perfect 16 hoppers allegedly i i probably miscounted them but you know we're gonna try out 16 which that means i'm need a whole lot of you probably three stacks that should be good enough then we just start over here go to that first slot now just go through break all of this go like that and beautiful which i think i love this so much more and oh my we dang okay so three and a half stacks just from like what five days of decorating this now so that's working pretty fast i'm pretty happy with this farm okay next up very luckily i can make this part super cheap i just need to come to the chest and we're gonna put one there and maybe like three right there and by doing that if we come around to the chest we should hopefully not be able to see okay wait uh i just realized i i just needed like one log there okay yeah let's go get a refund and now we very luckily don't need to make this super huge eh, we'll just bring out like four blocks i don't think me putting any blocks like right here will mess with that whatsoever and I think I want to make this look just completely standalone. So maybe, hmm, maybe, maybe like a, like a, like a cooling tower kind of a thing, or I don't know, just something for me. We can actually have like water running down certain areas inside of it. Maybe this is where, you know, I don't know, the coolant is stored. Uh, first off, I think should go around and finish off this line. Not like that. Now for this section, I do plan on covering everything. So I think we can actually just go really cheap and we'll just make like a rough line out of just planks because this won't matter whatsoever, hopefully. Okay, and I think that's perfect for the bottom layer. And then for this section, hmm. So maybe on the corner, you know, like not like that, but maybe on the corner pieces, we actually have uh, some deep slate on them, just like that. And then maybe we make this too high. Okay, ooh, and then in between these, okay, so if I had more, we'll do one there and then we're gonna do another one on top. Ooh, and I love that. Yes, yes, yes. Ooh, and then out here, we can actually copy that design with this. And then we can have you like that, 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 that maybe? Okay, up next, up here. Okay, so all of these corner pieces will do this. I don't know what to do with this corner piece, but I really don't like it. But I think this works. I think that works. Ah, what? Where are you? You die. But okay, I'm liking the uh, the bottom half of this now. I, I think this works out very decently well. Stupid jellyfish. Then, uh, let's see. So very luckily, uh, hmm. Okay, so I don't think we need to go very crazy up here, but I want to start building the tower, like the cooling tower up here. My God, that thing is huge. Not like that. And then, so very luckily, making it super duper tiny and like kind of close together like that. I've now just realized I need to make these stone. Hold up. Okay, anyways, now we just go around with our corresponding blocks just like this. And then I'm actually gonna be leaving that spot right there open for glass. I mean, I might do it there as well just so we can actually see some of the water. Okay, beautiful. And then the bottom of the floor doesn't matter. And then now we just have the super duper fun process of going back and forth with water. I'm not gonna lie, uh, I'm now realizing it. I don't know why I just put in all of this water at this height. Um, that uh, wasn't exactly like really smart. How am I 
line. Okay, so in funny news, yeah, we're gonna go up three more. <laughs> okay, now this should be the right height because I, I still, I want this higher than that. So I think at this height, we should be completely fine. And I guess it wasn't a waste because I could just go down below and then pick up all of these water sources and then just move them up, so. And I don't think we actually need to do anything else to that because you know we still haven't done this whatsoever so i don't know maybe this will flow in with that who knows but i think this looks fine you know i think this is good Ooh, i did notice one little spot that i kind of missed and i think this will improve it if we add it there yeah what i think we're done and then hmm for the top of this i mean we could just be super boring and then just oh my god not jump down like that that, that that was not planned. Oh my dude, really? Oh no, dang it. Oh my god. Okay. I, I'm just really dumb right now. Okay, now don't be dumb and fall. Let's make sure that we're safe. Now, for the top of this, I think it'll actually look really nice if we go for a glass roof just on top. You know, just something really simple, really fast. Can, can I help you, dude? But I think we're done. Uh, if anything, like I'm, eh, I'm not like too happy about how skinny it is up there, but I think it works perfectly fine. Ooh, also, okay, before we go and start working on the walls and the top section, I need more leaves. Oh, I swore my life that wasn't planned. I actually have two iron on me. I guess when I was trading, I didn't use everything. I swear my life I did not uh, plan that out as if I ever planned out anything. I don't know why I had to clarify that. Now for the blurring reason on why I, I collected all these leaves, just like how I did right here, I need to do right here. And oh God, I realized that I still need so much bamboo. Ah, so much better. Oh, it just looks so right having all those leaves there. And with having the railing right here, I don't think we need to add any green to this machine i mean it's supposed to look very industrial and you know it's still not done so that's why it doesn't look so happy but oh dude i'm loving how this is turning out so far this is actually looking really really nice to me and now oh god okay well now it's time to work on the glass which this should hopefully be really easy so if we go like that i hate that <laughs> i really don't like this instead we need to outdo this that actually works pretty decently. The next part, how to do this. I guess instead of doing like fancy stuff like that. Oh wait, no, because of here. Okay, so maybe, oh, actually here, we could do it somewhat like this. Uh, no, okay, can't connect them at all there. Uh, Okay, maybe like that? I guess that, why did I just hear a skeleton? Oh my God, why do I see a skeleton? How did you spawn? Oh, I guess I didn't go to sleep fast enough and you spawned out here. Oh, that's really unfortunate that you're in the water. Ooh, ow, you shot over that? And actually, no, give me your bone. Ah, uh, yep, that sucks. Okay, but maybe for corner pieces, this works out. Cause maybe for the corner pieces, we just go kind of thick, you know? I mean, okay, wait, wait, here. Let's see it actually built a little bit. And ta-da, whoa. Ooh, wait, 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 wait. One more thing. We need to add some walls if I can hopefully reach this. Uh, uh, okay, maybe we need to make it like a little bit thinner. Maybe uh, not two blocks over to the side. I mean, maybe I, uh, God, I really wish that there was something that I can use that was like really skinny on the sides. Maybe we just need to actually copy this little like steep wall with the other wall design. Like maybe full blocks like this just isn't the move because I, eh, I don't like how much it blocks it off. Like I want something that just kind of hugs the corner pieces right there, but it also looks like it's supporting it. It kind of works. Like I don't exactly hate it. I just hate it how you can see the glass. Like I'm really, really not a fan of that. Oh man, do I need to go install those little half slab things? Like we, oh, I don't even think it's for this version. Oh God. Okay, wait, I, I might have some playing with mods to do it. I think I actually need to add some more stuff. Oh God, hi. Okay, so if everything actually works, uh, I added in a mod to where I could just break the slab that I'm actually looking at. So yeah, baby. Okay, so that's perfect for building. God, that helps out so much, you have no idea. If I go over here and then, yes. Oh my God, yes. I'm sure, we'll just make the entire thing into that. Boom, we have 48 vertical half slabs. Yes. So we go like that and that. Oh my God, that is so perfect. Oh, maybe we actually don't do anything with the sides. Oh, wait, wait, wait. I think I like that idea. And I think I actually want to leave the walls. 
No, do I? No, I think I want to use vertical slabs instead of walls because I feel like this just looks so much more appealing. So now for the two center pieces. Oh, and I think I really like that. Now this could slow down the growing rate of like kind of a few of the sugar cane. I'm, I, I think I'm okay with it. Okay, so we figured out the design across all of the walls. I'm going to leave the ceiling roof part empty for now because i don't really know what i want to do for that part um god do i feel like doing this right now um uh we'll come back to that i kind of have an idea with this but now basically just gonna go through and uh copy what i did over here to this side right here okay perfect so i believe yeah okay yep that's nice so i believe i copied over everything perfectly fine and looking at the roof again up here boy do we have some fun stuff because i'm trying to think of a way to hide this but, oh no we don't want to because of that but i do want to cover at least all of the redstone because I, I just i don't like leaving redstone out into the open like this i feel like it's just super easy for it to get broken and now especially since we're at the top to kind of switch things up because you know it's just a lot of deep slate on here so we really need to add some kind of coloring and a part of me really doesn't want to remove like the view from the glass oh so actually now that we have vertical slabs i was i was going to use logs but oh yeah i think this will definitely be a lot better yes yes very very nice especially if we were to ever be above this we can at least still see the uh the moss and that covers it up perfectly still leaves in the glass view so we can still see through it and everything so if i can actually position this correctly i think it was like that yeah oh okay but if we can not do it like that so this there we go okay perfect so very obviously this goes perfectly with the uh, the vertical slabs right there then we can you know slap on these two things i kind of want to strip them yeah i think we'll strip them yeah yeah we'll make it you know uh fit like that then if we bring this up again so now we could put this over the uh the redstone dust we can then use regular logs except for right here because that breaks the machine um maybe we just do glass actually no okay we're not gonna waste wood on this because you know i don't think we're ever gonna see this again but we leave glass right here redstone can still go through that boom and even though this isn't important whatsoever but let's do the exact same thing that we did to the other side over here now for all the logs up here we're not going to strip these we're going to actually leave them how they are and now we get into the tricky part um i think this is the side that we're going to be using torches on oh and also this side over here because i really 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 want to leave some leaves on top of this i think it'll make it look a lot nicer looking which i think and okay let's break you hopefully get it nice and we leave you there with glass right there and i think we're fine so sadly we will be seeing the torches but you know i kind of want these things to grow and now we can safely add in leaves i think i want to do leaves here and leaves on top of here because i just i think that'd just be the nicest plus then this will at least bring in some color to our very dark base and ooh, i'm liking this i think we need to add something to the strips right here i, I think signs that's honestly probably going to be the best answer for that but oh yeah especially with the lights turning on in there yeah i'm liking that Ooh, i kind of want to add some torches or something to the uh the underside down here now oh not bad technically uh, i've now been in this world for one year day 365 okay let's go first off i need more torches oh just use some lanterns yeah shut up God, uh, never mind that actually look nicer but um yeah plus you know it'll make it look a little bit uh, nicer and richer inside so with dealing with lanterns if we go like that boom it'll actually go into that one i don't think that should be blocking anything i'm pretty positive it's okay to leave the lantern in there like that Ooh, so we can't really see it until it's nighttime. i mean i could probably place these a little bit better instead of like in specific number order which would probably be better especially if i hide it behind the pillars so we don't see them which i honestly kind of want to do now that i just said that out loud uh that's that's alarming um where's everything <laughs> Wait, you're not picking up anything? Why do I feel like it was that? Okay. There we go. Okay. So it's because of this lovely thing, isn't it? Oh god, is this full? That's that's a lot more sugarcane. Okay. Yep, that is that is a lot more than uh, what I have in my chest. So we'll break you and we destroy you. Which that should be sending off all of the stuff. And wait, that works? 
So now when I go back to my chest, we should be saying everything go in. There we go. Okay, now it feels a lot better. So this entire time that I've been building, we've done over a line of sugar cane. Not like that. So, uh, here, give me a little bit. I'm actually gonna go through and fix all of this. I want to change the placement of all of the lanterns. So they are nice and hidden. I think that should be fine, but the lanterns are relatively hidden, or at least hidden as well enough as I could you know, do with what I'm working with in here. And yeah, I think that's completely done. Other than the other side, I still need to finish that. And hello, wow, you work really fast. That is really nice. Okay, now with the little bit of remaining sunlight that I have, let's go over here. Luckily, this will be a super easy job. And there we go. Okay. Very nice. Yes, yes. Ooh, I'm loving this. Uh, I don't know if I'm loving this though. I'm not gonna lie. I kind of I kind of want to change that out with some uh deep slate. I think that would look a little bit nicer. Actually, we could just see if it's nicer. Yeah, I won't lie. Ooh, okay. Uh no, I don't want to be here with the fishes. Okay, as I was saying, yeah, I think this is nicer. I, I think I like that little uh, color change right there. So let's actually go do that to the other side. Ooh, also being over here, I mm, I would add lanterns, but I honestly don't know if I need to. Actually, eh, we'll do it, why not? Okay, there we go. The entire place is lit up, everything is done. We just need those signs. And this place should look really nice at nighttime. Why do you still have water? So before I go and mass produce a lot of signs, how do you look? I really hate that. <laughs> okay, maybe we need to do a different kind of slab. Oh, what would it look like with the wooden slab? I think I love that. Yeah, I think I like that way more than I like this one. Yeah, yeah, I like that. I like how it breaks up the colors. I'm almost tempted to do it down here, but I think the signs, like being a different uh, height and color than these vertical slabs, I think that's uh, a nicer fit down here than up there. And now, just like every other project that I work on, I think I think I want to pull myself away from this. Um, I know in the beginning of me building this, I said I want to do some spikes in the corners, but I don't know. I feel like that would... Oh, please don't be thunder. Um, I feel like that would take away from it. I think I'm happy with this. I, I don't think I need to add anything else. Please, are you thunder? Okay, good. So our sugarcane farm is completely done. And the entire time that I was building this, we, oh, we got two glass as well. Huh? I didn't know those uh, actually grew glass. That's kind of cool. Oh, that's right. So wherever the lanterns are, they just won't grow three high. Let's be honest though, with how fast and how often this machine works, I really don't think any of the sugar cane will ever get to three blocks tall. So eh, I I'm okay with that. I really just don't care. <laughs> Next up, before I go and do anything else, I think it's time that we go around with some uh, trap doors and we start adding them to all of the leaves. Uh, yeah, yeah, the leaf blocks here. And not too shabby. We actually got like half of it done. Okay, and now we can... Yeah, we got time. Okay, yeah. So we'll go over to our lovely tree farm. Make some nice speedy work with our new axe. Oh my gosh, this is actually so much faster. Oh my gosh, it just looks so beautiful. Oh, I love this massive machine. Okay, so we'll play it smart. We're just gonna do one stack, do that. And perfect, not bad. Only 14 left. And other than the bamboo, I would say that this place is pretty much done. But like now thinking about it, you know, when I was like kind of finishing up the place and placing down the, uh, the trap doors. I think I want to mirror this build over here for the bamboo, but we will be changing it up pretty slightly just because, you know, we want the bamboo to grow a whole lot tire higher, taller, because uh, having two and like three block tall bamboo sticks in certain areas, it just isn't gonna work. And, uh, you know, kind of looking at it, um, yeah, this place is going to be really, really tight. But, um, other than that, I think we're good, you know, uh, let's just get a little organized, put away all that stuff. And very sadly, before we even start building the other machine, seeing how much, uh, deep slate and stone that this took, uh, we should probably go mining again. Now, before any of you comment it, yes, I know I can actually make a stone farm with lava. However, I don't think there's any way to make deep slate. And honestly, I might as well just go mining for both of them at the same time. You know, we'll start out with stone and then we'll just go down to a deep slate. So also, how have you guys been doing? My word. Okay, now we're getting somewhere. Now we're unlocking another emerald trade, which I'm still noticing you guys leaving a whole lot of produce on the floor. So yeah, you guys kind of suck oh hi and we're off 
and now thinking about it, just so I, you know, can come back with some kind of profit other than just stone and deep slate, we can actually just go to our old mine shafts, but you know, we don't need to go all the way down there. We can just start extending them. Ooh, there we go. That's, that's not too bad. Ah, day 369. Stop laughing. Now, just for a pretty shot and just to get this day through even faster, I just did a line of stone. Uh, probably, I mean, I'm, maybe someone used that line before in life. So I wasn't exactly planning on filling my inventory with just stone and like whatever blocks I got from here as well, but I did. So now we need to make it back home. So I just headed on up the stairs, got in my boat and across the ocean, made it back to my base surprisingly. And then I just went straight over to the barrels. I got as organized as I could. I really just threw everything away. And then I just immediately got back into the boat, went straight back to the mines. And I went down to the deep slate mine area. However, this journey was so long that I kind of didn't really get to mine that much, but I tried to get as much as I could today, which was like maybe half of a line in my inventory. So not too much, but it was something. So that last clip was about two days ago, and um, if you look at me, you're probably going to be noticing, oh wow, everything is really different. You know, I have a lot more levels, uh, my armor is different, my tools are different, and you're also going to notice that my raft is different. Everything that I have now just done in this movie has been completely undone. For those that don't know the replay mod, how I do those really beautiful cinematic shots and time lapses, once you finish recording and like rendering them and you know you don't need them anymore you would go to the mod and then you would select the file and then delete it which is really really similar to the delete a world button for anyone wondering no mojang doesn't have a confirmation button if you want to delete a world and no it also doesn't save any deleted worlds to a certain folder on your computer in case you were accidentally you know to delete it so it was around 4 or 5 a.m i was tired. I was going to go to bed soon, but I just wanted to finish up just a little bit more of the recording. I did that time lapse where I mined down below in the mine shaft, and then I deleted the replay file, and then I also deleted the world file because I was distracted and tired, and I was watching a live stream while doing that, and I forgot that I deleted the replay file, so I deleted the world as well, and um, yeah, the second I clicked confirm, I immediately knew exactly what I did. Over the past two days, I've been using a recovery program to try and see if I can find the world and see if I can recover it at all, but that is uh, to no avail. I, I'm not lucky. I recovered some of the files, but it didn't recover anything that was actually playable. I tried to Frankenstein this world to see if I can put together like some of the files to hopefully get it to, you know, go back to the uh, the previous world save. Um, At the very least, not all is lost. This this is the 300 days save, so it's literally like I've done nothing whatsoever for the 400 days, but I'm pretty sure, you know, it's understandable that I have no desire to redo what I just did. Like, I'm, I'm kind of just, like, defeated for this world right now. Um... I might go into creative and then redo everything that I did up till day 370, but I'm honestly not sure. It kind of just defeats the point of this world. I don't know, it, just, it, it kind of just loses its charm. So yeah, I, I'm not sure what to do. Uh, if anyone knows how to recover a deleted world, if you want to hit me up on Twitter, that'd be awesome. I've tried everything that I could think of. I'm not blaming Mojang for it, but I am blaming them for making it so easy to delete a world and have absolutely no way to recover it or any kind of confirmation. I think that is incredibly stupid for any game, any kind of program on a computer. I think that's incredibly stupid. I, I blame the majority of it on me, but I'm just, I just really can't be asked to redo everything that I just did and like redo the video, especially since it was almost done. And I really need to go and record other videos as well, just to keep up with the schedule. And because, you know, I just enjoy doing that. So this definitely wasn't the ending to this movie that I was hoping for. This is not what I had in mind whatsoever. Ever. Um, sorry for the sad ending. Um, the next video will probably just be 500 days and it'll be us catching up or, you know, everything will just be magically done because I've gone into creative mode and redone everything. So I'm not sure. Uh, really sorry that this is ending 30 days earlier than, you know, the full 100 days. So I'm, I, I don't know. I, I hope you guys can understand it. Uh, really sucks, but, you know, don't worry. The series isn't over. I will continue it. It's just I have to build up the uh, desire to record again. So might be a little bit, might not be 
waited that long, but yeah, uh, that's what happened. Um, it's been awesome. Uh, at, at least then, you know, it won't be that difficult to recreate everything that I've done. Cause like, I, I kind of remember it as luckily those 70 days was me also figuring out how to build everything and blah, blah, blah. But yeah, um, it's been super fun. Uh, sorry, the video's ending this way. Uh, I'll see you guys on the 500 days whenever, uh, if anyone knows how to save a world, please tell me on Twitter or my discord server. And, uh, yeah, I'll see you guys next time. See ya.